why should people visit it? People should visit for the cream teas. <laughs> In this film, we go to some of the best climbing spots around the southwest. Yeah, we just walked up at Blacknall, um, just on the west side of Portland, some sport climbing. This place is amazing. We're just here to sample some of Portland's best lines. Jenna warms up on Talking Smack. It's a really cool flow staying route. That's it. Really amazing holds, like massive flow stone all the way down. So loads of kind of pinch grips and laybacks, uh, interesting moves, some good feet, some smears. Interesting, interesting climbing. Portland is really good all year round and there's hundreds of routes to go out here as well. Yeah. <laughs> it's one of the best sport climbing areas in the south of the UK. So we're here on the Colm Coast checking out Sharp Nose. Um, probably my favourite crag in, in the southwest. Ah, it's just got really good climbing, amazing holds, flowy, flowy routes, um, good gear, safe, uh, pumpy. Yeah. yeah, we've been battling the British summer. We arrived and it was it was pretty blowy. Um, the sea was pretty rough. The spray was um, just being swept onto the crag. So we had to sit it out. Unfortunately sit around. It wasn't too bad, it's amazing views. Waiting for it to dry up a bit. So we can get into some climbing. It's pretty it's pretty remarkable cliff actually. It's just um, it's 150 foot high and about two foot wide and it juts out into the Atlantic Sea. And um, I've no idea how it's still standing but it is. We started on Out of the Blue, which is E2, yeah, um, it's really sustained, reasonable gear, but yeah, it's just sustained, sustained climbing, pumpy, superb E2. Yeah. So we're, we're calling it a wrap here, and we're gonna jump in the cars and make the drive down to West Penwith to check out some of the granite down there. So we're at Senen, which is pretty much Land's End. It's a, one of Cornwall's premier coastal granite crags. It's been absolutely beautiful today, really, really sunny, really nice day. So we've been down making the most of the glorious weather at Senen today. It's a pretty stunning location, just above the sea, although it's not too tidal, especially when the sea's calm. Climbing is um, classic trad, cracks, breaks, grooves. Generally quite technical, um, with requiring a bit of, bit of that sort of old, old school trad gnarl in the, on some of the crack climbs anyway. Uh, we started off on Samson and Rhett, which is a stunning, stunning flake line. Um, next to the classic route, demo route. Um, sort of pretty techy climbing into a really stiff crux for an ET. <laughs> um, and then above that, it's just awesome, just um, romping up to glory on, on these amazing druggy flakes. Oh, that was freaking awesome, yeah. That was amazing. Such a quality route. There's a little bit, a little bit damp down there today, which made it a bit spicy, but uh, no, it's awesome. Yeah, really good. So today we're climbing at Anstey's Cove in South Devon. It's very steep. Down at Anstey's, the best sport climbing in the south. Conditions have been quite good, it's not been too hot down here. So we've been able to do some hard routes. So I tried Empire of the Sun, that was the first street of the day. Classic route of the beautiful Anstey's Cove. It's quite steep, real big moves, <laughs> but really good fun. Today I got on the classic AK of the Crag Cider Soak, well known across the UK as being one of the best hard routes. Really, really good compact limestone, but it's packed with quality. We've got three different sectors here. Each sector is very different in style 
Anstey's is like one of the best places to climb out. Steep climbing, uh, good steep climbing. Anstey's Cove is a cheaper alternative to going to Europe sport climbing. It's that good.